everybody. We're back for another episode. Amazon Prime has given us a season two trailer for The Wheel of Time, and we are here to react to it. I am excited. Uh, Amazon does this every so often where they will give us kind of a teaser for this season, and we have mm -hmm. a teaser for season two, including behind the scenes things, and I'm looking forward to seeing it. All right, me too. Let's have at it, guys. Avienda, Avienda, already. Slow walk Starts on the beach. Uh huh. Oh, very the slow. Beach. Oh, rally car. That's a lot of smoke. Smoke Ooh. in the desert. All right, That's we're awesome. familiar with that. And we, who is this man? Why is he have yellow on his shirt? What is that? Wow. Slow, a lot of slow walking so far. Way gates. That is a way gate. That's uh, a jungle gate. Where is this? Is this? This is where the That's... dragon comes in with the Maris. Oh. Alright, a little smoke, more smoke. More more beach scenes. Is that that was man? Who is that lady? Who's that? Who's that little dude? Alright. Battle scenes. Oh that's amazing. Ooh, is that Matic going in and Galat? Is that a dead person on the wall? Alright, I think we see a mirror drawn a door. Who's that person with like the, the gold on her face? Oh my god. <laughs> Alright, let's go through this. Real quick, here we have, I believe, Avienda. With some Ryan, what does it say on the bottom of that clicker? Oh, I think it says Sahara, uh, Sanaa Hamri. That's okay. the director. Sanaa Hamri, producer and director. Okay. And we got A376 7 16L and the number two. So everyone. Get your Dakota rings out. <laughs> Get your Dakota rings out. Ryan, you officially passed the DMV vision test. Well done. <laughs> Thank you. All right. So this is, I can't wait to see. Avienda looked just amazing. Right. The Cadensor and the uh, Shufas. The Shufas. That's, that's kind of how I pictured them as well. All right. So did not picture this ever happening. I do love how Maureen's in front, of course. <laughs> well, here's what's happening, Ryan. Are you sure that they were around here? Yes, Lan. I dropped my keys right around here. <laughs> Are you uh, using the power? <laughs> <laughs> All right. Wheel weaves is wheel weaves. All right. So it's the one time you can finally say it back to her. Of the Subaru following the horses. We want to talk about this structure. We have a, some sort of wooden structure, the mechanical wheel, possibly a trebuchet of some sort. Um, this is odd. We seems like the white cloaks are in the desert that's fun that's fun they're <laughs> everywhere Ryan there you pick the smoke <laughs> machine of all smoke machines Megadeth is uh, jealous and then we have this iconic wheel it's already iconic I swear this is so great so what do you think is going to happen with this Dan real quick who is going to be racked up on this bad boy um predictions my prediction is it is a white cloak device. Okay. I don't know who's going to be strapped on there besides some sort of I said I assume. I, I can't see who else would have it. It might be the IEO have this. I mean, um, it, it can't be the Ace and I because don't they cut off their hands? <laughs> How are you going to put those hands in those cuffs up there? <laughs> they're, cut off. <laughs> they're teeny, teeny cuffs, right? All right. And this. Okay. This is seagulls. great. I walk along the avenue. Actually, no, I, I'm looking closely. It is embroidery of the highest order. No, this is great. This is great. This is a really involved costume. Look at the um, the shufa itself. It's like fine linen. Who do you think this is? I want to say that this is cooler than. Oh, he's cooler than I thought. Then <laughs> he's the coolest in. Okay, cooler than. All right, I'm gonna go with uh, Ruark. Hmm. I'm going Ruark. You're going cooler than Ruark to be as old as Tam. All right, so we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Men, just go. Who are these? Uh, what do we think's going on here? We're men. We're, we're men in tights. We're men in tights. Tights. Look at this house over here. That looks pretty modern. It, yeah, I'm, that's I'm, craft I'm, services, Ryan. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> are they on a golf course? <laughs> this looks like the toughest Easter egg hunt in the world. I don't know. This is a band of brigands. I'm going with band of brigands. Okay, I'm going um, uh, uh, warders. All right, jungle gate. 
Jungle Gate. Jungle Jungle Gate. Gate. This is very interesting. Just a wide open kind of training ground. They're loosely assembled. I see this guy in the top. He is looking just cooler than cool. He's not wearing any armor. He's got longish hair. See, wow. I'm fascinated by this guy already. I'm thinking this is Forsaken something. Mm-hmm. But but this person in the middle has very crazy, like foreign looking armor, like this ring around him. Yeah, I, I can't put this all together at all. But this it's guy- It's an interesting uh, location too. It seems that this is a ceremonial, um, I mean, it, the flooring is different than the rest of the, the keep it looks like. I want to say Shan Chan with their, these cra- this crazy armor, these super big shoulder pads. We have a woman right here. Okay, I'm noticing we have a woman right here in a dress, kind of a underwhelming explosion. And it, it was the small explosions tile. in the desert, Ryan, that are rare. Okay, the, it's fine. Do you think this is one power or just some sort of like a booby trap? <laughs> Um, we have not seen any gunpowder in this world, so I gotta assume that this is some sort of one uh, power. Some sort yeah. of one power. All right, yep, I'm feeling it. All right, moving on. Oh, that's a bigger. Oh, Joshua. Joshua. He is Joshua Jones in the Temple of Doom. Dun, 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 it's dun, good dun. to know that he's in the show. <laughs> this is what we get. <laughs> More romantic walks on the beach and different angles. There are no footprints there, Ryan. Oh, <laughs> you're right. They were, they just popped up there. <laughs> they were, no, that's me. Okay. Men, men being, um, being on mini. Being mini. Mini. She's like, <laughs> she's like, everyone's calling me a lamp, so I will be in the lowest lid scenes of the show. I'm dimmer. All right. Okay, we have Yosha again walking through some small town. Cool Where do we coat? think this? Where do we think this is? She's already left the boar. Yeah, this I'm could be anywhere. This could be anywhere. Like this, this is just anywhere. Anywhere land. Is this Hinderstep? I want to say uh, Ilian. Okay, this really like the outskirts. Well, they have. It looks like it could be like a fishmonger place. Now we have this montage of heads, Pat and Fane. Who is this person? Hmm. Look at that. Well, we have, let's see what we can see. We have uh, greenery. We have this cool thing above her head that's uh, the awning to the door. It looks like it's a sun, perhaps. Okay. Maybe they're uh, in Kyrian. I think this is the person who's lazily hanging out. Yeah, I think it's a Forsaken. I think he's, okay, that's fascinating. Possibly hanging with the Sanjin. Rand, Damage Red, Fane. This is a hobbit mixed with a Jawa mixed with Darth Vader. I think so. I think so. It has a Darth Vader helmet. Right, so this is cool. It looks like they just kind of built this up out of no in the middle of nowhere. Uh, this this is going to make for some great shots. We've got the water uh, and the mountains in the background. What do you think that is, Ryan? I some sort of, some sort of like a courtyard that is probably going to feel like it's attached to a bigger bigger castle thing. I don't think it's yeah. supposed to feel like it's just stuck in the middle of nowhere. Yeah. But this is pretty impressive, pretty big. We got some fighting. We got men in red, which could be I I want, first I wanted to say this was Logan's folks, but these people seem more organized. I think yeah. we're seeing white cloaks battling with these people wearing like red my guess would be uh these might be andorn soldiers or uh soldiers of tarvalon white cloaks are everywhere man i think they're 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 the baddies they're the baddies and this shot i was so excited to get to it she's got the greatest bag is that louis vuitton the delicate nature of that um i guess you would call it ivory work it's supposed to be is Mm -hmm. fantastic you see the blue screen there so they can just pop in any any old background they want. And they're always having this amazing uh, shadowing effect in, in Tarvalon. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. With the gilding. Well, because Tarvalon's a shadowy place, right? All right so it could... Th- who, who is this? I'm, I'm saying this is Matt with Galad and Gawain. Because it looks like Tarvalon, right? This looks like a... That's the mm-hmm. stone working of Tarvalon. I think we know that Matt is in Tarvalon. Maybe this Correct. is part of maybe this is part of his like rehab, re- rehabbing. He's like he got he gets healed by somebody and he's rehabbing, and then maybe he creates a friendship with Galad and Gawain as they train together to get Matt healthy, and then at some point 
bada bing bada boom he bests them i don't know i'm just going with yeah it looks like they were doing something choreographed so to me this looks like more of a training montage that may turn into a fight rafe just loves just burning down old places <laughs> burning down the house He'll build it up and then burn it down. Boom. What do we think is going on? This is our axe yielding hipster, who I'm saying is Ruark, battling this guy who just, I think, flipped over the axe. I think he didn't even, that's a fail. Oh, look at his I do not think that that's an IEO with the axe at all. Um, it, his face is uncovered. And that robe, that that cape, isn't really a. Ca- I, know, I don't. I don't know what's going on. Maybe, do you think it's white cloak? I think that this is no. I think it might be someone from like Ilian or it. it did, so like, didn't Shia uh, grab great, great captain? Didn't Shia grab the cape of the woman, uh, the man that was trying to kill her when she gave birth? Uh, and yeah. it was something like this, was it not? Ooh, okay. Ooh, okay. Well, maybe, maybe. You think there's bees on there somewhere? There may be bees. Um, yeah, be there bees. may be bees. This has got to be Perrin. Yes. Right? There's the merge roll. Stuck to the door. I don't know why this guy is continuing to threaten. He's not going anywhere. <laughs> Here we go with these, uh, these green and blue. Okay. So there, the, Perrin is certainly with an organized band here there is a uniform going on uh-huh and it does look like the same sort of um clothing that those nine dudes in the forest were wearing. yes i think they're the same yeah yeah and then we have this uh i'm assuming a lady with the long long hair long braids or maybe it's a could maybe, be a dude it could be a dude with with dreads yeah yeah can't tell. It's all good. Oh, I know. We're going to get all of Daniel by the end of this. <laughs> <laughs> Just, looks like Moraine. Looks like Moraine. No, he's there, but that's, uh, he's not smiling now, is he? He's not smiling there, no. He's not smiling there. Ah, I'm going two on. It's got to be two on. <sighs> you you no know what? There, that no sounds there. like something that the Shanshan would do where you cannot look at the Empress's face. <laughs> yes. The Empress, may the light defend her or whatever. May she live forever. The Empress does have a voice as someone who uh, her only job is to speak for the Empress. That could be this the one, voice. That could be the voice. Everything is covered except for her mouth. Oh, nice. Okay. I like that idea. Uh, this is cool little battle map I'm saying. I'm think, seeing. Looks like gummy uh, bears. It's got to be a Shanchan because there we go. You gummy bears. <laughs> um, we got the ships. Maureen! Wait, Maureen encounters the, the Hobbit of a Jawa and a yeah. Darth Vader. Okay, good, good. Scares all deep. I, I so just off the top of my head, Pat and Fane, merge all on the door. That was sick. Mm hmm. The wheel. The, which is what is that? Just a, is that a is that a torture angriel? <laughs> Tortangriel? It's a terangriel. It like tears your soul. <laughs> There's it asunder. Um, beach walking. Uh, you know, beach uh, walking. Yeah. We had a couple scenes that looked like they could have had been like um, like an '80s romance uh, or a Calvin movie. Klein um, perfume. <laughs> <laughs> oh, um, all right. So overall impressions, I am excited. Wheel of Time is great at this. Uh, they got me super excited for season one. And then uh, we'll, we won't talk about that. But now season two is coming out. We're, we're, I'm back. I'm back, baby. This well, is, what, uh, what we see is a consistency in um, really epic shots, sweeping uh-huh. vistas. We have uh, the beach scenes were awesome. Looking, yeah. uh, I mean, I I just kind of like those sweeping shots, and and they did a lot of that in the first season. It looks like that's going to continue, and that, I mean, that to me was one of the highlights of the show was its cinematography, and I, uh, it gave the scale of the land, and it looks like that's going to continue. I agree. Um, we I don't. Here, what are we What are we missing in this trailer? We we did not see any CGI, which makes sense. They, that comes later. I'm stoked to see more Pat and Fame. Yes, I'm, def- I'm definitely. I want to. I actually want to see him killing that murderer. I want to see it. I want to see him pinning it. I want to see how it go- goes down. 
I want to see fear in the in the Lamprey Eel's face. <laughs> Pat Fain has the best smile. And when he rides into town, into the two rivers, he's all, no sweets for you. No, no, ha, ha, ha. I want yeah. him to do that to the mirror draw. <laughs> no, no, no sweets for you. No sweets for you. <laughs> you get a knife. <laughs> Yeah, so what do you think is going on with Moraine and Lan on the beach? Hmm. I wonder where they're at, to be honest. We know that she's not able to channel, and that's a, that's a thing for sure, but I, mean, I don't know. I don't know where they're going with that. Yeah. I, th- I think they're like, their Tinder profiles obviously have long walks on the beach. <laughs> long, long walks on the beach. The sunsets. Yeah. Sunsets, long walks on the beach. Tide pools. White, white, red wine. <laughs> tide pools? Rollerblading. No one says tide pools on their... No one says tide pools on their Tinder profile. Well, that's why I always get sl- swiped right, I guess, because... <laughs> Sw- sw- <laughs> Dang it. <laughs> tide pools. Well, that's certainly fed some speculation here as far as what we're going to see in season two, right? I'm Ryan. And I'm Ryan's brother, Dan. And then we are the way to leave. Join us again as we anticipate season two of The Wheel of Time. Bye. Bye. Bum, bum, bum.